Whoopsie. Well, hello, hello, everybody. Oh, yes, it's J2 Sweet here with new hair. I know, right? I, I just, I, I like it. I don't know. I, okay, I don't know if I like it, like it, but I know I like it. Anyway, my name is Shay Too Sweet. You call me Shay for sure. And in today's video, we're going to be doing the illustrious, the infamous, the has been hotel. Links for the original creator will be down below. I'll be your resident black friend talking through the whole entire thing. Hey, look, look, I have got a black. So let's go ahead and jump into it. This is going to be 31 minutes. So I hope you go ahead and get you something to eat and, we'll, and come out here and come back back. Okay, that's all I was going to give you. You knew it was going to be a premiere. We have premieres every night. All right, make sure you leave a like on this video. Thank you. Hello. At the end of the rainbow, there's happiness. And to find it, how often I've tried. That girl got fat ass. But my life is a race, just a wild goose chase, and my dreams have all been denied. Why have I always been a failure? What can the reason be? That's how that's how you capitalize on business. They just accidentally they just accidentally have an accident. <laughs> I'm always chasing rainbows, waiting to find a little bluebird. Shout out to shout out to the the girl who sung this song. Her voice is immaculate. I, I, okay, her verse is illustrious, beautiful, a songstress, somebody who I actually want to listen to over and over and over again. Oh my god. Uh uh. Sorry, I have a technical difficulty. I was clearing out my necklace and I I I didn't have a top. I just started filming. I don't like filming without my necklace on. Hold on. I did one video this whole time without her being on. She has to stay on. Give me a second. There you go. Perfect. She's on backwards. Even better. <laughs> <laughs> Even better. So let's let's go ahead and keep going. Huh? Oh damn. Huh? Oh, I'm alive. Yay! I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the fun time, hot stuff. Yeah, yeah. Listen, keep this discreet. You hear me? I can't let it get out. I'm offering my services to randos on the street. It was a quick cash grab. You got it? <laughs> Whatever you say, <laughs> slut. <laughs> Ouch! Ooh, such an insult. Let me know when you come up with something creative to call me, you sack of poorly packaged horse shit. Tell the missus I said hi. Snuck him. Back up. Boom! <laughs> Show. 
Oh my god! My drugs! Damn it! Those other cowardly sinners dare not hinder my territorial takeover! A wise decision! The power of my machines are unmatched! No other demon can compare to the likes of I! Gee, that was pretty swell! Boss? Yeah! You really showed them what for. I liked when you shot them with your ray gun. I wish he'd shoot me with his ray gun. At this rate, I will seize control of the entire west side of the pentagram by day's end. And nothing, not a single beast in this inferno of suffering will be able to take back this empire from my constrictive grasp. be mine and everybody will know the name of sir Bill. Lord! pardon who said that Is it what did you just say to me you fried chicken fetuses speak up that wasn't us mr boss man you looking for a fight Old man. Why the Okay. Okay. Shay, where are you gonna go with this? Okay, if you sometimes a girl would want I need love, okay? She got a nice body. <laughs> yeah, she's a demon. Okay, I get it. And she don't know how to match her shoes. Alright. I understand it. Okay? I get that she can't match her shoes. And she has one eye. But can you see her ass on that? Bruh. Sexy. Crazy. Per no, you know what? I'm sorry. I had enough of crazy girls. No. But she is pretty to look at. <laughs> you get that Tinker Toy bullshit off my turf before I smash it! More. Oh! You wanna go, Missy? Well, I'm happy to oblige! <laughs> I'm not scared Good afternoon, I'm Katie Killjoy. And I'm Tom Trench. Chaos out of Pentagram City today as a turf war is raging on the west side between notable kingpin Serpentius and self-proclaimed spunky powerhouse Cherry Bomb. That's right, Tom. After the recent extermination, many- a Sorry, I'm your ch 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 Cherry Bomb. Hello, where are you? Wow, okay. Uh, this, this, it's called Cherry Bomb by the Runaways. It's so good. I love that song. I'm your ch 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 cherry bomb. Cherry bomb. Anyway, it's, it doesn't matter. Areas are now up for grabs. Demons all over hell are already duking it out to gain new territory. Those two seem to really be going at it, huh? Looks like they're fighting tooth and nail for that hot spot. <laughs> and I'd sure like to nail her hot spot. <laughs> <laughs> you are a limp dick jackass, Tom. Or should I say... No, dear. Coming up next, we have an exclusive interview with the daughter of Hell's own head honcho, who's here to discuss her brand new passion project. All that and more after the break. Suck it up, you little bitch. She's crazy. Okay. You remember what to say? Yes, let's do this. Just look at me, and I'll mouth it to you. Come on, Baggy. I know what to say. I just feel like we need to, I don't know, make things sound more exciting. Ooh, what if I sing, sing a song about it? <laughs> you knew I was gonna say that. Because I know you. But please don't sing. This is serious. Well, you know, I'm better at expressing myself than my goals through song. But life isn't a musical, hun. Fine, but I have these other ideas of what to say. The highlighted bits are the best parts. <laughs> uh, it's all highlighted. <laughs> is this a drawing? Yes, that's the happy ending, see? <laughs> Everyone's smiling and happy in heaven. I don't think it's that simple. Just please follow the talking points we went over. And do not sing. Okay, fine. Mm -hmm. I'll just have to result to my impeccable improv skills. <laughs> Hi, I'm Charlie. Katie Killjoy. I'd say it's a pleasure to meet you, but that would be a lie. You can put that away. I don't touch the gaze. I... <gasps> I'm 
I'm Charlie. Katie Killjoy. I'd say it's a pleasure to meet you, but that would be a lie. You can put that away. I don't touch the gaze. I have standards. Yeah? How's Huge. That, how's that working out for you? Look, my time is money, so I'll keep this short. You're not here because we wanted you here. You're here because Jeffrey couldn't make it for his cannibal cooking segment. You might be some royal big shot, but that doesn't mean shit to me. I'm too rich and too influential to give a flying fuck about what some tux-wearing demon princess wants to advertise. But I... So don't get cute with me, honey, or I will fucking bury you. And we're live! Welcome back! Oh, oh Charlotte! <laughs> it's Charlie. Whatever. Tell us about this new passion project you've been insistently pestering our news station about! Well... <clears throat> As most of you know, I was born here in hell, and growing up, I always tried to see the good in everything around me. Hell is my home, and you are my people. We... we just went through another extermination. We lost so many souls, and it breaks my heart to see my people being slaughtered every year. No one is even given a chance! I can't stand idly by while the place I live is subjected to such violence. So, I've been thinking, isn't there a more humane way to hinder overpopulation here in Hell? Perhaps we can create an alternative way to change souls through... Redemption? Well, I think yes. So that's what this project aims to achieve. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm opening the first of its kind. A hotel that rehabilitates sinners. A rehab? You know, cause hotels are for people passing through, temporarily. <laughs> Is this girl for real? She thinks, you hear what she thinks? She, <laughs> oh, she's nuts. I figure it would serve a purpose, a place to work towards redemption. Yay. Oh my Stupid god. <laughs> Look, every single one of you has something good deep down inside. I know you do. Maybe I'm not getting through to you. Oh no. I have a dream. I'm here to tell about a wonderful, fantastic new hotel. Yes, it's one of a kind right here in hell. Hate a ring to a specific Inside of every demon is a rainbow. Inside every sinner is a shiny smile. Inside of every creepy hatchet wielding maniac is a jolly, happy, cupcake loving child. We can turn them out. They'll be heaven filled with just a little time down at the happy hotel. So all you junkies, freaks, and weirdos, creepers, fuck ups, crooks, and zeros, and unbound superheroes, all is here. I love you, friends, loves and losers, sexual deviants and boozers. Anything because right when I get my house, that's gonna be my that's gonna be <laughs> literally that's gonna be my that's gonna be my uh filming room. It's literally gonna be nothing but happiness. Now, now this is a really creepy freeze frame, <laughs> and I, I mean, like, I'm like this when it comes to like when it comes to I'm like this when it comes to children, like that, and 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 those are the badass kids, but. <laughs> Literally, literally, my stream, my it's it's gonna be my filming room. It's just gonna be nothing but just happiness all around it. It's gonna look like it's just gonna look 
It's gonna look, it's gonna be full of stuffed animals, okay? All right, it's gonna look like I'm hoarding stuffed animals. That's how much happiness is gonna be in a goddamn room. Anyway. Wow, that was shit. <laughs> <laughs> What in the nine circles makes you think a single denizen of hell would give two shits about becoming a better person? You have no proof that this little experiment even works. You want people to be good just because? Well, we have a patron already who believes in our cause and he's shown incredible progress. Oh, and who might that be? Oh, just someone named. Angel Dust? The porn star? You fucking would, Tom. <laughs> in any case, that's not even an accomplishment. I'm sure you can get that hooker to do anything with enough booger sugar and lube. Oh, I beg to differ. He's been behaved, clean, and out of trouble for two weeks now. Breaking news! We are receiving... A new player has entered the ongoing turf war. Let's go to the live feed. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, indeed. It looks like the one who just joined the battle is none other than porn actor Angel Dust. What a juicy coincidence. You must feel really stupid right now. <laughs> Ratings! Don't look at this. Well, it sure looks like your little project is dead on arrival. Tell us, how does it feel to be such a total failure? <laughs> Yeah, well, how does it feel that I got your pen, huh? Bitch! <laughs> Oops. Hey, thanks for the backup, Angie. <laughs> you kidding? This is the best action I've seen in ages. Where you been, anyway? I thought you up and died or some shit. Oh, I wish. I've been staying at this crappy hotel on the other side of town. Some broads are letting me stay rent-free if I play nice. You know, no fights, no pranks, no problematic language. Her words, not mine. <laughs> These crazy bitches are no fun. They've been clean for two weeks. Holy shit. Well, sort of clean. <laughs> as clean as you can get with a shitload of Bolivian marching powder. <laughs> oh, harder, Daddy. Son. <laughs> There's so many daddy issues to unpack on that one. I'm just gonna leave it alone. You whores have no class. In war, the side remembered is the side with the most style. Or the side that ain't dead. That like alive or something? Oh, well, that's none of your goddamn business. Mm -hmm. Now is it? Would that make your hat the top and you the bottom? Ooh. I'm going to blow you to bits. Kinky. Oh, not mm. like that, pervert! <laughs> not so cocky now, are we? You know, you really gotta watch what comes out of your mouth. <laughs> uh, I've been making these sex jokes the whole time, <laughs> and it's obvious you ain't catching on. I mean, it's just sex! So think you're gonna get in a lot of trouble for this? Eh, what's one little ball gonna cause? <laughs> Why won't anyone help me? <laughs> You haven't changed. You know you're my favorite guy to party with. You know it, sugar tits. You ready to finish this? Born ready, baby. Oh my god. What? 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 What were you doing? I owed my girl buddy a solid. Isn't that a redeeming quality? <laughs> Helping friends with stuff? Not with turf wars that result in territorial genocide. Eh, you win some, you lose a few hundred. <laughs> it wasn't that bad anyway. I had to! My credibility was on the line. I mean, what kind of yeah, reputation would I have if people found out I was trying to go clean? 
Thank you. It just throws out my entire persona. Your credibility? What about the hotels? Your little stunt made us look like a fucking joke. <laughs> no, 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 babe. Jokes are funny. I made you look... Uh, sad. <laughs> and pathetic. Like an orphan. With no arms. Or legs. Damn. Uh, oh, with progeria! Great! Now I'm bummed thinking about it. <laughs> this thing have any liquor? Can you please just try to take this seriously? Fine, I'll try. Just don't get your taco in a twist, baby. Was that you trying to be sexist or racist? Whatever pisses you off more. <laughs> Is there seriously no liquor in here? I'm gonna kill him. Too late, but Wait! Would that make me double dead? <laughs> Where exactly do I go? To double hell? <laughs> exactly, that's what I'm saying. Sorry, you're stuck with me, bitch. Get used to it. <laughs> Listen, who cares if some Jagoffs got hurt? Most of them are ugly freaks. Look around. You got a bunch of fucking Harlequin babies down You're here. one to talk? Hey! This body is flawless. Oh. Everyone wants some of me, and I got the creepy <laughs> fan that is to prove it. <laughs> <laughs> That was really uncool, you know, Angel. Uncool? After that train wreck, there is no way anyone is gonna want to stay at the hotel. All thanks to you and your selfish bullshit! Does that mean I don't have a free room anymore? <laughs> ah, well, shucks. Hey, come on. We don't know if things are over yet. Try to relax, Baggy. It'll be okay. Yeah. It's probably a good idea to get some actual food in this place. You know, to feed all the wayward souls you got in here. But, um, the interview didn't go well, and I don't know if I'm going to make a difference. I don't know what I'm doing. I could really use some advice, Mom. I... I think Dad was right about me. <laughs> well, anyway, I'll stop talking before this gets long. Love you. Bye. now? You mm. may. Alistair, pleasure to be meeting you, sweetheart. Quite a pleasure. Excuse my sudden visit, but I saw your fiasco on the picture show, and I just <laughs> couldn't resist. What a performance! Why, I haven't been that entertained since the stock market crash of 1929. <laughs> so many orphans. Stop right <laughs> there. I know your game. And I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone here, you pompous, cheesy talk show shit lord. Dear, if I wanted to hurt anyone here, I would have done so. <laughs> He's such a nice now person. Now I am here because I want to help. To say what now? Help! <laughs> Hello? Is this thing on? Testing? Testing? Well, I heard you loud and clear. Um, you want to help? With... This ridiculous thing you're trying to do. This hotel. I want to help you run it. But... Why? <laughs> Why does anyone do anything? Sheer, absolute boredom. <laughs> I've lacked inspiration for decades. My work became mundane, lacking focus. Aimless. 
I've come to crave a new form of entertainment. <laughs> Does getting into a fist fight with a reporter count as entertainment? <laughs> it's the purest kind, my dear. Reality, true passion. After all, the world is a stage, mm -hmm. and the stage is a world of entertainment. <laughs> So, does this mean that you think it's possible to rehabilitate a demon? <laughs> of course not! That's wacky nonsense! <laughs> Redemption! Oh, the non-existent humanity! No, 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 no! I don't think there's anything left that could save such loathsome sinners! The chance given was the life they lived before! The punishment is this! There is no undoing what is done! So then, why do you want to help me if you don't believe in my cause? Consider it an investment in ongoing entertainment for myself! I want to watch the scum of the world struggle to climb up the hill of betterment, only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fiery pit of failure. <laughs> Such a nice person. Right. Yes, indeedy. I see big things coming your way, and who better to help you than... Uh, so, uh, what's the deal with smiles over there? Wait, you've never heard of him before? You've been here longer than me. The Radio Demon, one of the most powerful beings Hell has ever seen. Eh, not big on politics. Ugh. Decades ago, Alistair manifested in Hell, seemingly overnight. He began to topple overlords who had been dominant for centuries. That kind of raw power had never been harnessed by a mortal soul before. Then, he broadcast his carnage all throughout Hell, just so everyone could witness his ability. So he's like a live streamer. Oh my god, so good for his time. Sinners started calling him the Radio Demon. As lazy as that is. Many have speculated what unimaginable force enabled him to rival our world's most ancient and destructive evils. But one thing's for sure. He's an unpredictable source of danger, a wicked spirit of mystery, and a violent monster of chaos, the likes of which we can't risk getting involved with unless we want to end up erased. You're done. Mm, he looks, looks like a strawberry pimp. Yes, it's well, a I don't trust him. To be fair, do you trust any man? Any men? <laughs> men. <laughs> Facts. Charlie, listen to me. You can't believe this creep. He isn't just a happy face. He's a deal maker. Pure evil. He can't be redeemed. And is most likely looking for a way to destroy everything we're trying to do. I... Uh, we don't know that. Uh, look, I know he's bad, and I know he probably doesn't want to change. But the whole point of this is to give people a chance. To have faith, things will be better. How can I turn someone away? I can't. It goes against everything I'm trying to do. Everything I believe in. Just trust me. I can take care of myself. Charlie, whatever you do, do not make a deal with him. Don't worry. I picked up one thing from my dad. You don't take shit from other demons. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, Al, you're sketchy as fuck, and you clearly mm -hmm. see what I'm trying to do here as a joke. Mm -hmm. But I don't. I think everyone deserves a chance to prove they can be better, so I'm taking your offer to help. On the condition that there be no trickster voodoo strings attached. So it's a deal then? Fuck them. Nope. No shaking, no deals. I... As princess of hell and heir to the throne, I, uh... Hereby order that you help with this hotel for as long as you desire. <laughs> Sound fair? Hmm. Fair enough. Cool beans. <laughs> Smile, my dear. You know you're never fully dressed without one. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I start smiling? <laughs> so where is your hotel staff? Uh, well. Oh, you're going to need more than that. And what can you do, my effeminate fellow? I can suck your dick. Ha! No. <laughs> your loss. Well, this just won't do. I suppose I can cash in a few favors to liven things up. Little darling is 
Nifty! Hi, I'm Nifty. It's nice to meet you. It's been a while since they've made new friends. <laughs> Why are you all women? I didn't mean I'm here! I'm sorry if that's rude. Oh man, this place is filthy. It really needs a lady's touch. Which is weird because you're all ladies, no offense. Oh my gosh, this is awful! Oh nope, my. nope, nope, <laughs> nope, 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 <laughs> nope. Ha! Read them and weep, boys. Oh. <laughs> What the fuck is this? <laughs> you. Ah, Husker, my good friend. Glad you could make it. Don't you Husker me, you son of a bitch. I was about to win the whole damn pot. Good to see you too. <laughs> what the hell do you want with me this time? My friend, I am doing some charity work, so I took it upon myself to volunteer your services. I hope that's okay. Are you shitting me? Hmm. No, I don't think so. You thought it would be some kind of big fucking riot just to pull me out of nowhere? You think I'm some kind of fucking clown? Maybe. I ain't doing no fucking charity job. Well, I figured you would be the perfect face to man the front desk of this fine establishment. With your charming smile and welcoming energy, this job was made for you. Don't worry, my friend. I can make this more welcoming. If you wish. What, you think you can buy me with a wink and some cheap booze? Well, you can! Hey, 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 no, no bar, no alcohol. This is supposed to be a place that discourages sin. Not some kind of, now, brothel man king. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> we are keeping this. <laughs> All right. Go fuck yourself. Only if you watch me. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Welcome to the Happy Hotel! You are going to love it here! I lost the ability to love years ago. So, what do you think? This is amazing! <laughs> it's... okay. <laughs> this is going to be very entertaining! <laughs> you have a dream you wish to tell And it's just laughable, but hey kid, what the hell? Cause you're one of a kind, a charming demon bell. Now let's give these burning fools a place to dwell. Take it, boys! <laughs> Inside of every demon is a lost cause. <laughs> but we'll dress them up for now with just a smile. They will coronate this cesspool with some old redemption flair and show these simpletons some proper class and style. Oh, here below the ground. Your plan is sound. They'll spend a little time down at this has been home. Ah, well, well, well. Look who it is harboring the striped freak. We meet yet again, Alastor. Do I know you? Oh, yes, you do. And this time I have the element of surprise. Such a nice person. Well, I'm starved. Who wants some jambalaya? My mother once showed me a wonderful recipe for jambalaya. In fact, it nearly killed her. <laughs> you could say the kick was right out of hell. Oh, I'm on a roll. Yes, sir, this is the start of some real changes down here. The game is set. Now. Stay tuned. <laughs> oh, my God. So welcome, that was the Hasbin Hotel. I loved it. I always have, I always will. I love the Hasbin Hotel. It's one of my favorite, favorite, favorite pilots I ever had, I ever watched. So I hope y'all had a good time. Links with original creators will be down below. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. I thought that almost said Dave Chappelle, but that didn't. Dyslexia is real. Links with original creator down below. Please leave a whole bunch of likes on this video. Please, please, please. 
please i would i would greatly appreciate it i never have a like goal but if you could can we get this video to a thousand likes for me please something i'm, I'm trying i'm trying to i'm trying to hit i'm trying to hit over i'm trying to hit twenty thousand. you guys so help us help a black girl's little dream out all the all the links for my descript all the links for my other channels will be down below again my name is shay too sweet you can call me shay for short and like my grandmother always says so long girls play baby i love when she gets a character Watch your bust it down for the camera Might go poor cause she never looks like an amateur Want it longer, I'ma flex a little stamina Oh, she like to dress up, I know